Once more to Randall. Randall shakes on Osmond down the lane. He hammers it and gets fouled. Oh my. Julius Randall drives a smooth Range Rover now. But how did he get here? His life, lifestyle, and more coming up now. Julius Delon Randall was born in Dallas, Texas on November 29, 1994 when Carolyn Kyles welcomed in a bouncing baby boy. He was raised by a single mother with one older sister. His mom was also a basketball player at the University of Texas. Randall wears the number 30 jersey in tribute to his mom. He was a Kentucky Wildcat where he averaged 15 points and 10 rebounds in his only college season. Julius was selected 7th overall in the draft by the Lakers. He got to play with Kobe and he said Kobe taught him a lot and was lucky to come into a situation like that. Imagine getting the opportunity to play alongside one of the greatest to ever play in his last season in the NBA. Randall learned the Lakers way and all the towering expectations and pressure that comes with it. Randall actually suffered a devastating broken leg in his first ever NBA game. Though his stint with the Lakers was pretty short-lived, Randall impressed more and more each season. His scoring average rose each year as he continued to wield more of a featured role on the offense. But the Lakers gave up on him just before LeBron James arrived in town. It would have been fun to see Randall play with LeBron after Kobe. But on to the next stop, the New Orleans Pelicans. And though going from LA to the Big Easy is a downgrade in lifestyle, with all due respect, Randall's game upgraded, big time. Randall's game flourished as he blossomed into a star forward for the rebuilding Pelicans. The team at that time was dealing with the Anthony Davis trade saga. Randall averaged 21 points and 9 rebounds in his only season in NOLA. He then took his talents to another large market when he went to the New York Knicks during the summer of 2019, a move that would help Randall emerge into a star for a franchise that had been starved for star talent for so long. Randall answered the bell in his second season as a Nick. He got his first All-Star nod, earned Most Improved Player of the Year, and an All-NBA selection. A season of near-individual perfection that validated Randall as a great forward in the league. Though Randall is still seeking that next step that will launch him into superstar status, he's on a steady uptick nonetheless. So with that, let's see how Julius makes that paper. Contracts Randall's rookie deal was a four-year, $13 million contract. In 2018, the Pelicans offered Randall a two-year contract worth close to $18 million with the final year being a player option. And after a breakout 2019 campaign, he firmly declined his player option in pursuit of a more fabulous payday. And that's exactly what he got from the Knicks, who gave Randall a sweet three-year, $62.5 million contract to be the man of the franchise. For those counting, that's an average salary of around $20 million per year. Two years is all it took for the Knicks, and they were sold on Randall. So they decided to make him a cornerstone and offered him a massive four-year, $117 million contract extension. And that's an average salary of $29 million per year, making Randall among the highest paid players at his position. His deal ends after the 2026 season, where he'll be a free agent at the age of 32. Let's see if he can take the Knicks to new heights. Julius has gotten the perks of playing for large market franchises like the Knicks and Lakers, which has given him the opportunity to create a big time lifestyle. Endorsements Randall is a Nike dude and has been with them since getting drafted. He's worn Kobe's mostly throughout his career. We love it when he rocks the Kobe 1 Proto and Kobe 5s. Go get you a pair. He also recently inked a deal with the apparel store JD Sports. He and his son Kaiden have a one-of-a-kind deal where the little guy will be the face of their kids section. He also has deals with Levi's, Celsius, and Vroom, and he's done some work in commercials with Mountain Dew. Randall is raking in that dough, baby. Let's see how he spends those Benjamins. Houses Julius has a French provincial-style custom home in New Orleans. Features include a resort-style pool, spa, and backyard. It also sports a gourmet kitchen and floor-to-ceiling windows. 
A bright open floor plan for entertaining comes with a spectacular theater and bar. And this is a smart home that has a sauna, heated bathroom floors, and a luxurious master suite. It's over 7,700 square feet with five bedrooms. When Randall moved, he sold the house for $2.6 million. Randall is now in New York and we couldn't find anything on his new pad, but from the looks of his old house, we think it has that classic style. Jewelry. Some of the jewelry Randall owns is indicative of his life and his upbringing. He has a stunning watch collection that includes a frosted white watch with a purple dial that is limited to 200 pieces. And then bracelets. Bracelets with unique designs that each represent a different time in Randall's life. Each bracelet that has the name of his two sons and his mom. Cars. Randall's first NBA car purchase was a Porsche Panamera, which he called his dream car. He then copped a cool black Range Rover with Forgiato rims. He's also been seen with a smooth black BMW i8 with suicide doors. Talk about mobbing in style. Charity. Last year, he made a pledge to donate $500 for every three-pointer made during the season. The proceeds would go to the Bronx's Earl Monroe New Renaissance Basketball School for the reading and math programs. He ended up raising $60,000. During the pandemic, he and Bobby Portis also donated $50,000 to City Harvest, which is New York's largest private food bank. Keep up the great community work, Randall. Diet and fitness. Suffering a broken leg before reaching 20 years old, Randall got serious about his body throughout his rehab period. He dropped 20 pounds in his rookie season alone to help his recovery time and protect his body from battles with injuries. And overall, it worked. He's been generally healthy since. Randall even credited Magic Johnson for the way he trained, saying the following, Magic issued me a challenge to get in the best shape of my career. That was something that really resonated with me and I started to take my weight very seriously from that point. After a lot of hard work, I really started taking conditioning and nutrition in the offseason seriously. As far as what he eats to prepare for a game, Randall said, I like a huge breakfast. It'll be some eggs, preferably an omelet, some protein. It has to be huge. My chef does a good job at switching things up with what I like. Then I'll take a nap, wake up and meditate again for about 30 to 45 minutes. Love Life. Julius is married to Kendra Shaw, who owns her own fashion and apparel company called Calor out of New York City. After being together in college, Randall proposed to her when the two of them were on a trip together in Greece. They married in 2017. Kendra recounts it as the best night of my life. I couldn't have painted a better picture. Words can't describe the way I'm feeling and how I felt at that moment. You are the best thing that's ever happened to me and I can't wait to spend forever with you. They have two sons together named Caden and Jace. The cute couple are still going strong and Kendra loves being in New York with her fashion line. Net worth. With still a long career ahead of him, Randall has risen to stardom and has looked like one of the very best players in the league during stretches. But now is the time. How much is he worth? With everything going on in his life, Julius Randall's net worth sits at roughly $25 million. For now, big time beast. <laughs>